Item Number SCP-6186 Containment Class Euclid Special Containment Procedures SCP-6186 is held in an airtight chamber constructed from glass to enable observation of the anomaly. This chamber is to be checked daily for any damage and repaired without delay if any is found. Currently, tests involving the anomaly have not yet been conducted. Description SCP-6186 is an amorphous cloud of smoke. This cloud does not disperse and appears to freely transform. Following observation and its discovery, the entity is believed to be sentient and possibly sapient. However, the extent of its intelligence is currently undetermined, as testing has not yet been initiated. Logs of its behavior following containment have been attached below. August 27, 2021 SCP-6186 was caught and transferred to its containment chamber. The entity immediately moved towards the wall where researchers were observing the entity. After 12 seconds, the cloud manifested an appendage, vaguely resembling an arm, and started knocking on the glass pane for two minutes before ceasing activity. SCP-6186 drifted to the center of its chamber and stayed stationary. Several minutes later, SCP-6186 manifested a second appendage and began moving towards each wall and slowly drifted across them as if it were feeling the confines of the chamber. August 28, 2021 for the majority of the day, SCP-6186 appeared to traverse the walls of its chamber. No other notable behavior was recorded. August 29, 2021 SCP-6186 began growing outwards. It had expanded to fill the entirety of its chamber and increased the smoke's concentration in several areas. When the chamber's exterior was examined, these areas were discovered to have faults capable of affecting the chamber's integrity and possibly enabling a containment breach. Containment specialists are unsure if they were caused by the entity. SCP-6186's containment procedures have been updated to include a daily investigation of the chamber's exterior. August 30th, 2021 SCP-6186 was stationary in its chamber. Researchers believed that they saw vague symbols forming through the smoke. Later on, the entity once again pressed against the glass and began creating indiscernible symbols and shapes. However, the entity stopped after several attempts and stayed motionless against a corner of its chamber. August 31st, 2021 SCP-6186 seemed to be unusually frantic. It was banging itself against the walls of its chamber. After an hour, it was motionless in a corner. Throughout the day, SCP-6186 began to level out and sink onto the floor. It remained unmoving for the rest of the day. Discovery SCP-6186 came to the Foundation's attention on August 27, 2021. Firefighters had been dispatched to the scene following reports of a growing forest fire. While responding to the incident, they had allegedly witnessed an unnatural column of smoke. This cloud of smoke was said to have flown against the wind and taken unnatural shapes instead of rising or dispersing into the air. After being picked up by local Foundation agents, MTF Epsilon-6 Village Idiots was deployed to track and contain the anomaly. The task force had found that the cloud had entered the Waltzen residence and had supposedly begun harassing the family present at the time, Miss Waltzen and their two children. The entity was captured using a modified industrial vacuum cleaner. After proper amnestization procedures were followed, SCP-6186 was brought to Site-19 and contained. Later analysis of the fire indicated signs of arson. The remains of Jack Waltzen, the paternal figure of the Waltzen family, were discovered at the site, with apparent signs of a bludgeoned skull. Further away from the scene, a heavy-duty bicycle lock covered with traces of DNA matching Mr. Waltzen's and an empty portable gasoline container were found hastily buried underneath some foliage. The perpetrator of this incident is currently unknown, and a police investigation is still underway. Thank you all so much for watching, and a huge thank you to all of my patrons on Patreon. Special shout out to Everborn, Joe Light, The Bone Man, Rubbishbin69, Tannis, Ruler of All, and Doomsday LLC, Prince and Design. If you'd like to help support the channel, head on over to patreon.com slash drmaxwell, link in the description.